Hello everyone, this is David from goldstartool.com and today we are going to ship out a Yamata FY9300-D4. Uh, it's a fully automated direct drive. The motor inside here, there is no motor down there, nothing. It's uh, with direct drive, motor is in here with uh, food lifter and fully computerized, you know, thread cutting option and all that stuff with a um built-in led life led light obviously we have our gold star light here and then a automatic bobbin winder uh and uh, on a table k-leg obviously when you get the machine depending on how you order it you might not get the k-leg you might get the t-leg if you order wheel you get wheeled with it but uh this is shipping out to a customer and i thought i'm going to do a video i checked on our website we didn't have one so you see this option right here? That's a knee lifter that usually all the machine have. Okay, and this machine has. Now, this is fully automated. Means like if I could put my feet on the pedal backward, the foot come up. See that one? So this is one of the options that people like to use. Now, another thing is that this Yamata 9300 doesn't have a regular bobbin. It has the M bobbin, large bobbin. A lot of people don't like to continuously change the lower bobbin. So this is the big M bobbin that I'm gonna show you in later on. It's a side load. I'm gonna open the head. This is the big bobbin, it's a side load. And everything is the same as the regular one. This, is, this machine needs oil. It has a uh, oil pan in here and whenever you get the machine and you get the oil, you will pour everything, all the oil in here. Look at this beautiful oil pump right here that pumps the uh, oil continuously into the sewing machine. And all the accessories, whatever you see here, are uh, what you need. If you receive the machine and this thing is hanging, it's normal, you let it hang, don't cut it. This is a whisk that in, uh, stays inside the oil and then uh, um, it will p also um, help the sewing machine going smoother and faster. Okay, so this machine is on a regular table. I'm not gonna go ahead and tell you all the, uh, I'm sure you've seen the table before I gave you the measurement. It comes with a compartment right here that you could your accessories in there. You get these four rubber legs four rubber legs that if you live in and work from an apartment building or studios, go on the bottom of your machine, stop the machine from shaking. You get two screwdrivers, you get a bottle of oil that the entire thing goes inside the machine right here. And then you will see this customer happen to order a deluxe kit. Um, we are shipping the customer some of the accessories that um, come with the deluxe kit. So like the needle on this machine is 135 by 17. It's not a, uh, it's a 135 by 17, it's not the regular one. Uh, M bobbins, these are large bobbins, we get a bobbin case. But the foot on this machine are all regular one that is on a DDL8700. This is a normal, a small, tiny, see? This one is smaller than the regular one, okay? This is the zipper foot left, zipper foot right. Uh, we have coring foot. We have a um, invisible zipper foot. And we have a bunch of accessories, tape measure, cutters, cleaners, and all that stuff. You will not get this with your order. I just wanted to let you know. I'm just sending this to a customer because this one was ordered by customer. Anyways, so as I said, this is the automatic bump, uh, sewing machine, but I'm gonna try it. You have reverse right here. You have uh, thread, um, uh, uh, the uh, stitch length right here. And I'm not gonna go ahead and touch this one, but this one is like, if you don't want the thread to cut, this is easy. A soft start, um, needle uh, position down, up, and then when you start the machine, you'll see that 
when you start, you could have the sewing machine go back and forth to start, you know, back stitching. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and start. We have, by the way, I have a very thick thread, it's T105, right here, T105. Like people that use denim jeans. This machine is not used for heavy walking foot stuff, but you see we have it on a three or four layers of cotton and um, you could do light material, you could do lingerie with this, you could do any type of sewing you want to do. But this is what we're doing, a thick material. A starting, you see? When you stop, cut, look at the back, beautiful. This is the back, these are the back, okay? The machine, and when you're sewing, as you could see, the bobbin winder is right here. It's going, now it's full. Maybe I have to press it again, you see? Okay, now, again, uh, if you want, the machine has also a back uh, reverse from here. You see, when I press this one, going, reverse, back here, tension right here. Now, if you're sewing and you stay down, you just wanna come needle, come up, you press this and the needle will pop out. I'm gonna do one more time, sew, needle down, pop out. Now, also here, there are all this option right here. Needle down, you'll see that was needle up, meaning that I'm gonna sew. Anytime I stop, needle will stay, come up. I'm gonna do this closer. I'm gonna sew. Whenever I stop, the needle comes up. That's needle position. Now, that's right here, one of these options. Now, this one will do needle down. I'm gonna do that for you. I'm gonna sew, needle down. Every time I sew, needle for sure stay down. You see that? And if you want it up, you just go ahead and press this one. Uh, I have some webbing here. I wanted to try to show you guys that it's gonna do the webbing also, look. I'm gonna do two layers of webbing. Here. Front, back. I'm gonna do more. Now, as you see, there is no back tacking. When you start and finish, you want a back tag, you could go here and add. You see that one? I add back tag, meaning that when I go up, I start sewing. This one is doing a lot of back tacking. See, it did a lot of back tacking. We don't want so many of these. Like whenever it finishes, I'm gonna come here and just, let me see. You see the back tacking to start? Right here is back tacking. I'm gonna show it on the white one, maybe you'll see better. And cut. Now, if you want less, and you want zero, you just put zero. If you want more, see right now I put zero. Now, I did on the webbing, you see two layers. I'm gonna do now on vinyl. So on vinyl, to show you guys how this thing is gonna work. You see the back and the front. Again, I'm gonna do it on a very slippery vinyl. Again, that's the middle one, the white one. And here, I got some spandex items, spandex. So 
see this is how fast how beautiful again i'm gonna go ahead and adjust the a stitch length. The back and front I'm gonna do, I did two layers, I'm gonna do four layers. Look at that, beauty. A beauty. I also am gonna do some muslin. I'm just showing, people call me all the time. Now, all the plate and the feed dogs and the rest of the stuff is um, same as DDL, Juki DDL 8700 or New Tech 8700. You could buy a folder for the machine, bias folder, hemming folder, whatever you need to buy, you could do it. Done, look at that, beautiful. See, this is the back, this is the front. I'm gonna do less, I'm gonna do a smaller stitching for you guys to see. The smaller stitching, the back and the front. A great, great machine, so you could do all type of needle, all type of um, sewing machine. See, back, back stitching. I'm gonna try this back stitching one more time for you guys to see. See? You see? I just pushed so hard on the machine. Anyways, a great sewing machine from Yamata, a FY9300-D4. If you have D1, D2, D3, D4, these are all the um, the newer model. Like when first is D1 and then come with D2 and D3 and D4. A great sewing machine. This is David from Gold Star. Tool, let me know what other video you want me to do for you. Thank you for watching.